Many primates, including humans, have particularly complex social lives, and dealing with all of these social relationships is potentially one reason why we've evolved such large brains and so many complicated ways of communicating with each other. We studied the social relationships of over 150 mountain gorillas and found that gorillas living in smaller social groups didn't have as broad a range of relationships as those living in medium to large groups. Then in the largest social groups, we found that the diversity of relationships that gorillas were involved in decreased again. We also found that gorillas in the same group could be experiencing very different social environments. Youngsters had the most diverse range of different relationships, and in females, this declined slightly with age. But in males, this declined rapidly towards adolescence. Male gorillas then regained a more diverse range of social relationships through adulthood, and this is when they usually take on key roles like caring for offspring and protecting the group. These findings emphasize the importance of taking into account how different individuals experience their different social environments. They can also help us better compare social complexity across different groups and different species, which may help us better understand how complex social behaviors such as our own have evolved.